the Turkish press reflected Western Armenia television. The presence of Russian peacemakers in Artsakh is in exchange excluding the status of Artsakh. Artsakh press Hadrus Dizak Kindergarten received new toys and stationery. Armenia is becoming a gastronomic wine tourist destination, Forbes, candidate for the first Armenian governor of Turkey in the history of the republic. Prominent Armenians who escaped the genocide priest Bresh Keshishan. Hambik Sasunyan is in Armenia and has sent a message. Let's support the state television of Western Armenia. The Turkish press reflected Western Armenian television. The Turkish news website Harbelar.com, referring to Western Armenia TV, presented a statement of Sardar Unsal, the vice president of the Turkish Azerbaijani Friendship Unions. In the statement, the above mentioned person spoke critically about our television, where he particularly mentioned that all our views, assertions, which consider the occupied Western Armenian and Armenian territory, are wrong. Unsal argued us to stay smart, to forget those assertions if we want to restore friendly relationships with Turkey. Otherwise, he threatens that there can be no question of opening the borders. We would like to remind Unsal that the leaders of his country were the first to speak about relations and friendship with Turkey. And to forget one's own history and bloody past is not appropriate for any civilized nation, especially if the perpetrator has never admitted his own crime on the basis of international law and has not paid any kind of compensation. Adhering to this principle, Western Armenia continues its work with the same assertions and the same idea. Armenia is interested in extending the presence of Russian peacemakers in Nagorno-Karabakh until the final decision on the status of Nagorno-Karabakh. As reported by the Russian status agency TASS, this was reported in the Office of the Secretary of the Security Council of Armenia. Unfortunately, the situation is not stable enough at the moment in the terms of security. Recently, we saw a ceasefire violation as a result of which an Armenian, a civilian, was killed and some were injured. Consequently, the role of Russian peacemakers in Nagorno-Karabakh will be significant until the issue of the final status of Nagorno-Karabakh is resolved, the Office of the Security Council of Armenia said. Referring to the TAS office, this information of TAS is remarkable in the context of information flows on the possible signing of agreements in Moscow. The Russian military contingent in Artsakh is for excluding the Ankara status. Putin and Lavrov have repeatedly stated about excluding the status of Artsakh. The condition of the presence of the Russian military arms with the status of Artsakh reaffirms this circumstance. German-based Ani Tunyan and Khachatur Partizan and together initiative responding to the Artsakh Human Rights Defenders post, according to which Hadrut's design kindergarten needs toys, linen and other stuff, has sent new toys and stationery to Artsakh. Hadrut's Dizak Kindergarten, reopened in Stepanakert, has received assistance today through the Artsakh branch of Mission Armenia NGO. Rita Sardarian, the director of Dizak Kindergarten, expressed her deep gratitude to the benefactors from the diaspora, just the kind people who support and inspire hope supporting Artsakh. We will be able to move forward with confident steps to continue our struggle, to create such a planet for our innocent children, where they will feel happy and safe. Sardarian said. Armenia has a great potential to become a favorite destination of gastro tourists for tourists from different countries of the world. As reports Armen Press, Anne Abel published an article about this in Forbes, who arrived in Armenia with tourists from different countries of the world to discover the culinary attractiveness of our country. In different parts of Armenia she tried the delicious flavors of Armenian cuisine and drank Armenian wine. There is intellectualism in this country. Chess is national sport here. The Matinadaran displays ancient printed books, precious manuscripts, illustrated color books, and miniatures. It says a lot about the Armenians who, during the genocide in the Ottoman Empire in the early 20th century, preferred to defend wonderful books. The author writes, she notes also that Armenian food is diverse and contains many interesting fresh species. The author also tells about the wide variety of delicate tastes of Armenian wines. The Egas Weekly published in Constantinople reported that Berg Akar, an Armenian lawyer living in occupied Western Armenia, received the right to become the head of the region, and if appointed governor, he would be the first of the history of the Republic of Turkey. It has already become known that Akar, who has successfully passed the exams proposed by the Minister of Internal Affairs, will take the post of regional governor in the near future. 
The Armenian people everywhere under any circumstances have proved the fact of being in love, devoted to their faith and education. Throughout history, Armenian churches have been a place of unification, not only of faith but also of culture. After the genocide against the Armenians, the surviving Armenians living in the border regions of Western Armenia built an Armenian school next to each church they built. There are Armenian schools next to each church in Serekania, Grespi, Chamishli, Derik. Dr. Ohanes, Auto Electrican Andro, Pharmacist Vartui, Armenian teacher Gohar, Hacho, Uncle Serop, or the last Armenians left in Serekania. Vresh Keshishan, original from Sylvian, Tigranakert, was very devoted to his people and faith. He was the Lord of the Father of St. Jacob Church in Serekania. Serekani was captured by the mercenaries of the Turkish army and ISIS after great destructions. The inhabitants were displaced. The father from Sylvan continued to listen to the Armenian prayers recorded by his father alone in St. Jacob Church. But Keshishan did not leave Serekania Church and the school next to it where 70,000 Armenians were massacred during the genocide. Now in a school next to the church where there are no students, there are Armenian books lost in the dust on empty tables and faded photos of children. Hambik Sasunyan is in Armenia and sent a message. Dear compatriots, I am happy to write to you from Armenia. After almost 40 years, I have the honor of being my native land, drinking my native water, bracing the air and feeling the warmth of my family. The support you have provided over the years has always encouraged me and made me positive contribution to my most difficult days. I would like to express my deep gratitude to all those who have written, visited and have kept me in their hearts forever. I am finally at home. With love, Hambik Sasunyan. Hambik Sasunyan was sentenced to life in prison on January 28, in 1984, for killing Turkish consul general in Los Angeles, Kemal Arkan, in his car. Dear compatriots, Western Armenia TV is not engaged in self-promotion, however, it represents Western Armenia and its residents. Our occupied homeland, Western Armenia and its population are in need of objective information and raising their own issues. Western Armenia TV is the connecting link with the help of which Armenians spread around the world get the opportunity to, the, to be in touch with compatriots and strengthens attachment to homeland and its roots. In this difficult struggle, we need the support of every Armenian to support Western Armenian TV means to support the recognition of the homeland and the restoration of the national identity of a deported Armenians. So, in this crucial period, let us be more united, understanding. Together we can do more.